Welcome to our first episode of Code Bytes. In this episode, we are going to talk about Python print statements. Right now, you can see that I have opened up Python IDE version 3.2, and my cursor is at the command prompt. The command prompt is represented by these three carrots. When I type in print, and in 3.0 or higher, I need to use parentheses. I'll type in hello. and my name and Python will print whatever is inside of the quotes. Now in versions before 3.0 the IDE required no parentheses. So if I try to type in the same thing without using parentheses, this would be a good statement in any Python IDE before 3.0, such as 2.5 or 2.7. But if I try to print a statement without the parentheses in 3.0 or higher, I get an error. And it says invalid syntax. A syntax error is when you have um, basically a typing mistake. You're missing a colon, you're missing parentheses, or something like that. Other types of error, like logical errors, deal with um, trying to divide by zero or doing another calculation that doesn't work and doesn't might work but doesn't produce the outcome that you want. So just remember that in 3.0 or higher you need to use parentheses around your print statements. So let's try some printing with some other things. So let's say I want to print a statement like your address. So I might say address and I want to um, concatenate that with a number that say the number that I live at. Python will throw an error and it's saying I can't convert an integer object to a string. So this is an integer 22277 and these are strings between the quotes. Plus sign is used to concatenate two strings together. But because this is an integer instead of a string, it throws an error. So we can correct this by converting that number to a string. And so we'll type str277 and because we've converted the 227 to a string it should work fine. Now notice that um, it's missing a space. So if we want to correct this, all we do have to do is add a space. If you want to uh, use the previous statement without having to retype it, all you have to do is use the up arrow, go in front of that statement that you want to use, hit enter, and it puts it next to your command prompt. Now I'm going to add my space here and hit enter again and now it looks better with this correct spacing. So computers don't care about white spacing and they only return what you tell them. So if you want a white, want to space somewhere, you actually have to put it in the string that you're using. Another thing you can do with the string is besides using a plus sign to concatenate two strings, you can use a comma and it has a little bit of a different result. So if I say print 12 comma, which is in a stew, then 
then it doesn't throw an error because it's not asking me to attach the number to a string. It's just saying print that number and then print the string literal that comes after it. So that's it for strings right now and I will see you next time.